Next, go for second problem. So suppose a hostel library has 12 books on mathematics, 10 books on physics, 16 books on computer science and 11 books on electronics. How many ways a student wishes to choose one of these books per study? Okay, this is the given problem. The solution is number of mathematics books is equal to 12. Next, number of physics books is equal to 10. Next, number of computer science books is equal to 16. And number of electronic books is equal to 11. Okay, now, number of ways, number of ways for selecting, for selecting mathematics book, mathematics book for study, mathematics book for study. So, how many number of mathematics books are there? 12 books are there. So, there are 12 different ways for selecting a mathematics book for study. Next, in the same way, so number of number of ways for selecting for selecting physics book physics book for study for study is equal to how many number of physics books are there that is a 10 next number of ways number of ways for selecting computer science book computer science book so is equal to so that is a 16 okay next number of ways for selecting electronics books number of ways for selecting electronics book electronics book is equal to so 11 days okay for selecting mathematics books so 12 days are there for selecting physics book 10 days are there for selecting computer science book 16 days are there for selecting electronics books that is the 11 days are there next number of ways number of ways for selecting number of ways for selecting either a either mathematics either mathematics or a physics physics or a computer science computer science and or electronics books electronics books is equal to is equal to okay so mathematics books for selection 12 ways plus physics books 12 10 ways and computer science books 16 ways and uh, electronics books that is 11 so 12 plus 10 that is 22 22 plus uh, 16 that is uh, 38 38 plus 11 49 so 49 ways okay so 49 ways are there for selecting either a mathematics book or physics book or a computer science book or a electronics book for self study so that is nothing but 49 ways are there for selecting either a mathematics book or a physics book or computer science book or a electronics book is equal to so 49 ways okay next go for the third problem so find out how many number of ways for selecting a prime number less than 10 
at the even number less than 10. Okay. So, less than 10, what are the prime numbers are there? So, that is a 2, 3, 4, 5, 7. Okay. So, less than 10 even numbers. Even numbers are 2, 4, 6, 8 and 10. So, these are the even numbers less than 10 and these are the uh, prime numbers less than 10. Okay. So, we are observing this one. This one 2 is there. This one 2 is there. But the remaining are completely different. Okay. So, here there are two tasks are there. First task is Task 1 is for number of ways for selecting a prime number. So, less than 10 is equal to T1 task. Number of ways for selecting uh, even number less than 10, that is a task 2. Okay. Either T1 task or a T2 task can be performed in M plus M base. If any duplication are there, then you can uh, delete the duplication step. Okay, now here two tasks are there. Task 1 is a uh, number of ways for selecting a prime number as a and the second one is num uh, number of even numbers uh, less than 10 that we have to select. So here number of ways number of ways for selecting Number of ways for selecting a prime number, prime number less than 10, prime number less than 10. So, less than 10, how many number of prime numbers are there? 2, two 3, 5, 7. Okay. For selecting prime number 2, so, one way is required. For selecting prime number 3, one way is required. For selecting prime number 5, one way is required. For selecting prime number 7, one way is required. So, the prime numbers less than 10, the number of ways for selecting the prime numbers less than 10 is 2, 3, 5, 7. For selecting prime number 2, so one different way is required. For selecting prime number 3, one different way is required. For selecting prime number 5, one different way is required. And for selecting prime number 7, one different way is required. So that is how many number of ways? That is the four ways are required for selecting a prime number less than 10. So, among the four ways, one way is used for selecting the prime number 2, another way is used for selecting the prime number 3, another way is used for selecting the prime number 5, another way is used for selecting the prime number 7. Okay. So, next one in the same way, second task, number of, number of ways for selecting for selecting an even number, an even number, even number less than 10, even number less than 10, or so 2, 4, 6, and 8. Okay, so 4 numbers are there, so that is equal to 4 ways. Okay, so here. For selecting even number 2, one way is required. For selecting even number 4, one way is required. For selecting even number 6, one way is required. For selecting even number 8, one way is required. So, this entire task belongs to task 2. This entire task belongs to uh, task 1. Either T1 or T2 can be performed. That means, we have to select either a prime number or even number. How many number of ways are there for selecting either a prime number or an even number less than 10? So, number of ways, number of ways for selecting, 
for selecting a prime number prime number or a even number prime number or a even number is equal to okay so here this task can be performed uh, independently this task can be performed independently but in the task 1 vertex 2 is there in the task 2 also 2 is there so for selecting a uh, 2 for selecting 2 one way is required here here for selecting 2 one way is required so we do not require 2 times for selecting a uh, number 2 so that we can say that 4 plus 4 uh, minus 1 that is equal to 7 ways. 7 ways are used for selecting a prime number or an even number. Okay. So that is a 4. 4 ways is used for selecting a prime number less than 10. And 4 ways is used for selecting a even number less than 10. Here minus 1 is nothing but here 2 is occurred. Here 2 is occurred. Okay. So because of that reason uh, minus 1 we are used so, 4 plus 4 minus 1, that is equal to 7 base. Okay. Here, same number can be uh, selected in the case of task 1 and in the case of task 2. Okay. Same number cannot be selected two times. So, for that one, we have to uh, subtract one time. So, 4 ways are used for selecting a prime number less than 10. And here 4 ways is used for selecting an even number less than 10. So, number of ways for selecting either a prime number or an even number less than 10 is equal to 4 plus 4 minus 1. This 4 ways is used for selecting a prime number less than 10. This 4 ways is used for selecting the uh, even number less than 10. And uh, in both cases, 2 is occurred 2 times. So, because of that reason, one time we have to subtract this one. So, because of that, 4 plus 4 minus 1, that is equal to 7 ways. 7 ways are used, 7 different ways are used for selecting either a prime number or an even number less than 10. Okay. So, this is the uh, description about the uh, sum rule and it's a three example problems. So, thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please share this video to your uh, friends and classmates. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel name. So, Divvela Srinivasarao. In the next video, we go for 